Hi everybody and welcome again to Z Code Sports System. Here we developed automated systems to help you win big every time. It doesn't matter what sport you're betting on, we've got you covered. So before we get into NFL action for week number six of the NFL season, I want to invite you to join so you will have access to the VIP club section right here, which has all the tools to help you make your picks. So as a full slate of action, we're going to take a look at the top four games for this week, in our opinion. The first one, the Baltimore Ravens and the New York Giants. The Ravens come in average up, and the Giants come in burning hot. You can see the Ravens are 2-2 uh, two and two over their last four, 3-2 and two on the season, while the Giants have won their last two, and they are 4-1 and one on the season. You see that the Ravens are favorites by odds of 1.41 to 2.868, which uh, translates to a minus 6.5 uh, point spread with an over-under of 45.5. If you look at the score predictor, the Ravens 31 to 18 with confidence in prediction of 53%, and you see here the 63% chance of the Ravens coming out on top in this game. If you take a look at the power ranking indicator, you see that the Giants are on the upward trend there at plus 24. The Ravens are at plus 20 at the moment. Let's look at the stability factor. You see that the Ravens are at plus three, the Giants are minus one, meaning the Giants have been inconsistent with regard to their favorite underdog status, probably because they are playing better than what people are expecting them to play coming in at four and one. If you take the look at the movement on the money line, you see it open for the Ravens at uh, 1.37. Then you see there's been some movement. It got to, uh, where do we have here? Down here, it got to 1.42. And then is now currently at 1.41 in favor of the Ravens. In the end, I like Baltimore by a touchdown in the game going over the line. The next one we want to look at is we scroll down through the list of games here for the week. And it's a full slate of games. The New York Jets have the Green Bay Packers. Another surprise team is the Jets coming in at 3-2, and two, equaling the Packers record at the moment. The Jets are burning hot winners of their last two, while the Packers are averaged down losing a game after their previous three wins, and they lost to the Giants 27-22. The odds are heavily in favor of the Packers, though, at home at 1.3 to 3.38, uh, with an over-under of 45.5, and you can see it's a 7.5 point favorite for the Packers at home. The score predictor has Packers 29-24 to with 53% level of confidence. If this holds true, this would go over the line, but the Jets would cover Look here, the Packers with a 72% chance of coming out on top in this game. The power ranking indicator shows that the Packers way up here at plus 29, and the Jets are at plus 17. The two teams playing consistently with regard to their favorite underdog stats. Well, if we take a look at this, you see that the Packers are moderately stable at plus 1, while the Jets are not there at minus 1. Let's take a look at the movement on the money line. And you see right now in the money line, it opened at 1.21 for the Packers. And it did get to, where is this right here, at 1.3, right around 1.3. And it is now at 1.3 as it stands. In the end, I do like the Packers in this one. I don't think the Jets are going to prove to be a, have enough on the road in Green Bay. So I like the Packers to win home in a game over the line. Next game we want to look at is going to be Buffalo. And Kansas City, once I get there, that's going to be the game of the day. Buffalo and Kansas City, both teams coming into play burning hot. Both teams at the top of their division at 4-1. You can see there's Buffalo. Their loss was to Miami 21-19. And Kansas City's loss was to the Colts 20-17. Buffalo comes in as a road favorite of 1.67 to 2.18. A line of minus 2.5 with an over-under of a very high 54.5. If you look at this, at the score predictor, Kansas City by a single point, 21-20, with that 67% level of confidence. And you can see how even this matchup is. We have Kansas City with a 51% chance of winning this game. It can be a very tight matchup. If you look at the power ranking indicator, you can see the tightness here as well. You see Buffalo at plus 27, Kansas City at plus 26. If you take a look at the money line here, opened at 1.9 for Buffalo, and you can see there's been quite a bit of movement and it is now at 1.67. So even more of a favorite for Buffalo now than there were before. In the end, though, I do like 
the Chiefs to win this game, though. The Chiefs at home. I like the Chiefs to win this game, but I like it to be a lower scoring than the line. So Chiefs and under the line. The final game of the day, Philadelphia Eagles and the Dallas Cowboys. This could very well be the game of the day as well. Uh, Eagles coming in 5-0. and Dallas coming in 4-1. and Battle for the NFC East. You see both teams are burning hot. The, the score predictor has the Eagles by 5, 30 to 25, with confidence in prediction of 73%. If that holds true, that would go over the line, which is currently at 42.5. And the Eagles are fair. It's 1.34 to 3.22 odds, which translates to their 6.5 point spread. If we take a look at the power ranking indicator, the two teams at the top of the league, plus 31 for Philadelphia, plus 30 for Dallas. Volatility oscillator, this teams have, have been very stable, as at least Philadelphia has been, plus five, Dallas at minus one. So take that into consideration before you place the bet. In the end, I like the Eagles at home. I think Dallas will cover. I think this will be a very tight game. I'm going for a field goal win for the Eagles, and I would avoid the over-under bet, though, because the, the line's at 42.5. I mean, Philadelphia has shown that they can score. Last week, they struggled a bit with Scoring in Arizona, Dallas is a really tough defense. The Eagles defense has been good as well. But I would say uh, Eagles to win, Dallas to cover, but avoid the over-under bet. So there you have it. Those are the games for this week in the NFL. Happy betting, and we will see you again next week.